I try to make a video introduction for the stack, like uh, the famous stream mystery, but yeah, as I was doing it, uh, I realized talking in front of the camera is pretty hard, so props to the guys that do it regularly, because yeah, I basically had very more, I had more problems than I thought doing it. Um, okay, back to the game. Yeah, I'll just leave him to deal with my creatures. Get Arthorison. So he has to come up with something to stop me. Um, lights out. So I don't know what effect the Mana Red has on his hand, but it's a bit annoying for me, but not the end of the world. Uh, I don't really have... so this deck doesn't roll many small creatures, so I the drawback wonder. isn't that uh, hard for me. My shield for Argon. Uh. So in general, it's not a good idea to um, leave the opponent mid with much more to work with. But yeah, I didn't bother trading much this game because I still feel I'm in a very good spot. Especially since um, Emperor Thorson will survive this round. <laughs> okay, so... Um, yeah, he will die anyway this so... Uh, I'll just go ahead and kill this one, because if... Okay, I was basically hoping it would be Malganis, so I could big game hunt him. Uh, Doomguard makes it somewhat difficult to do that. Well... Hey, lights out. Let's see. <sighs> I haven't done the math, so is he dead? Five... Six... 10. No, he isn't dead, but almost. If it's eviscerated, he's dead. Yeah. I'm trying to think of overrun effects he could play, but I can't think of anything. So I'll just forgo the deadly poisons and I'll just get out. The pilot shredder. So he basically has to remove my whole board and hope and pray that I don't have right to eviscerate. Uh. On a pagel here in disappointment, but um, Philip Nice is good. I like Philip Nice. I should I I should have hungry dragons earlier. Yeah, so so that would be that would have been nice if I weren't stupid. Um, okay, let's slow roll it. Shall not pass. <laughs> yeah. Whatever. Here we go. So uh, this game worked very well. Um, um, I haven't won yet, but uh, I don't believe I can lose from here. Yeah. Okay. There you go. So uh, what happened was uh, we had very good ways to deal with his early game and um, that's like the main strength of rogues in general we have like insanely cheap um, removal spells like 
backstab, and especially with the combo with SI7 agent. So we can remove their board, their minions on turn 3 or turn 4, while getting out uh, reasonably strong minions on our own. So thanks for watching, I hope I didn't bother this video all too much. Um, props go out to Alstar997 I think. Uh, his My decklist is basically a copy of his with um, some changes.